What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Aries, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the subscribe button to be notified of future readings. This free general collective reading for sign of Aries. This can resonate if you have Aries in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Feminine, but you've been charged. Stuff is basics, time is fluid, energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest. Free general collective reading for sign of Aries. Love you guys so much. Like I said, I received one channel message as I was meditating on Aries energy. <coughs> Excuse me for November of 2022. The channel message I heard was that Aries Feminine, Adult Aries Femme. I heard adult. Adult Aries Femme has an OnlyFans account. I heard it's very sexual. Very sexual. And um I also heard only me. No, I don't know what that is. Um, I know what OnlyFans is. I heard only me too. So maybe there's a something called only me. Uh, I heard only fans and only me. So whatever only me is, it might be sexual too. I heard whatever this is is very sexual. But um, whoever you are, Aries fam, with this only fans and only me and something that's very sexual, um, I heard you have made a lot of money off of it. However, you have a stalker. You have a stalker and a very obsessed stalker. And I heard they're not going to quit. It's masculine energy. And I heard they're not going to quit. And they live in your community. And you're about to start um, receiving very strange things about to start occurring to you. I heard particularly your vehicle. They're trying to disable you from getting out. Um, and it sounds like they're trying to do it through your vehicle. So, whoever you are and how this applies, Aries, um, somebody needs to check their vehicle. I would check um, under, you know, go get it serviced or something. Um, and I would be careful with whatever sexual crap you're doing. Um, and the, it's supposed to be the privacy of your home, but you're putting it out publicly onto the internet. So, that's making it, and apparently a community member in your community has access to it. Um, whether they pay for it or not, they know who you are and something to do with your vehicle. They're trying to disable you from getting out because I think they want you to themselves, Aries. Um, somebody needs to be very careful. You're an Aries fam. If this resonates for you, I would go get my vehicle serviced. Um, whoever you are and how this applies. Okay. So your messages to you have as Aries. This obsessed stalker is very criminal and they're very good at what they do. They're recruiting community members to do this. You're about to start seeing very, 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 very strange things happen to you all over the place, not just your vehicle. Oh my God, Aries fam, this person's coming in very strong. It's a masculine, obsessed community member. I heard they're very, cr very criminal and they're very good at what they do. And basically, um, it's not just your vehicle they're going after. I heard you're about to start uh, seeing very strange things happen all across the board to you. So not just your vehicle. It is an obs obsessed community member, but they are a member of your OnlyFans or Only Me, whatever the crap Only Me is. I don't know what Only Me is. Okay, somebody needs to be careful, Aries. You're an Aries fam. You have an OnlyFans and whatever the crap of Only Me is. Just saying, just saying. Haystack, karma, you will reap what you have sown. Not unsuccessful plans. Bear, danger, especially money matters. I heard this person's not going to quit, and they're collaborating with other community members to do it. They're, they have like a mental disorder. They will not, it's not like love them and let them go. It's tra entrap them. They are a member of your only fans or only me, whoever this community, masculine community member is, Aries fam. 
Only you know if you have an OnlyFans or only me. Patience, number 13, could be very significant number in one's life. Number 13, it could be a possible age of viewers, somebody you're connected to, or any other significant number, number 13. For one, you're about to find out you're pregnant with baby number two. For one, baby number three. For one, you're about to find out you're pregnant with baby number two. For one, baby number three. So, congratulations if um, you want to be pregnant, Aries. For one, you're about to find out you're pregnant with baby number two. For one, baby number three. So I'm assuming you're Aries femme. Um, desire, drive, and motivation. Um, sexual energy. Right. Um, one, baby number two. One, baby number three. That could be uh, money, danger, um, having to provide for another mouth, possibly. Um, with the dare, bear, danger, and money matters. One, you're about to find out you're pregnant with baby number two. One, baby number three. So... You plug it in how it resonates. Lots of desire, drive, and motivation in the bedroom recently. Now, whether this is with a committed partner or not, I don't know. Only you know your situation story, not anybody else. But one, you're about to find out you're pregnant with baby number two. One, baby number three. And one, you're about to give birth soon. And one, you're about to give birth soon. So a lot of pregnancy. So one, you're about to give birth soon. One, you're about to uh, find out you're pregnant with baby number two. One, baby number three. For one, your brother is about to come back into your hometown and visit for the holidays. For one, your brother is about to come back into your hometown and visit for the holidays. So whatever your hometown is and how that resonates, I heard your brother is about to come back into your hometown and visit for the holidays. Texas. And Louisiana is significant in this, and, Al and Alabama, and Florida. Texas, Alabama, Louisiana, and Florida is significant in this. So I feel you could live in Texas, Alabama, Louisiana, or Florida, or they could. Um, but they're about to travel back. Your brother is about to travel back into y'all's hometown to visit. I think you might live in the hometown, Aries. Texas, Alabama, Louisiana, Florida. I feel they could live there, or you could live there. How that resonates and applies. Confirmation for my kitty. An unexpected conversation with the Pisces is about to peak up uh, Aries' intuition in a huge way. For one, it's in a workspace. For one, it is family related. For one, it's your partner. An unexpected conversation with Pisces. So Piscean energy and Pisces energy right here on the third eye placement. Pisces energy strong. Um, unexpected conversation with Pisces, whether it's in your workplace, um, your partner or a family member. Heard it's going to pick up your intuition. So intuition on fleek. Um, now, this could go in a positive way or a negative way. I feel it could be good, good or bad conversation, but some kind of conversation with Piscean energy, masculine or femme, whether it's your partner, a um, somebody in your workspace, 3D workspace, I'm feeling, or a um, uh, family member. Swan.
For one, you were ugly duckling as a child. Now you have blossomed into a beautiful swan. For one, it is a femme energy of your past that is was an ugly duckling as a child. Now they have blossomed into a beautiful swan. Many positive things are about to happen to you. High vibrational Aries and this femme energy of your past. High vibrational femme energy. That's a good one. Okay, so for one of you guys, you're an Aries and you were an ugly duckling as a kid. So basically, people made fun of you, bullied you. You probably looked funny. Um, what have you, what have you. People made fun of you as a kid. Trust me, I got bullied a shit ton as a kid and that's just the truth. And uh, in apparently workplaces and retaliation as an adult in my 30s with kids, just saying. But whoever you are, for one, you were like an ugly duckling as a kid. So you look funny, you probably acted funny, you felt funny, whatever, whatever, whatever. Um, and you blossom into a beautiful adult. So swan energy, for one. Your high vibrational you treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrities, and values. Um, for That's for one of you guys. For one, it's you. For one, it's a femme energy of your past. Same situation, but it's just a femme energy of your past. I heard many, and you're both high, high vibrational. You treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. I heard you're about to, uh, both of you guys, you and the femme energy of your past are about to receive beautiful blessings, basically. Um, because I think you've done the inner work, the he healing, shadow work, the inner work inside of yourself. You're not only a physically, aesthetically pleasing, beautiful person on the external, but internally you are. You don't go around sabotaging people or talking negatively about people or gossiping about people or stealing people's money or committing money laundering, theft, fraud, extortion, embezzlement, or what have you, what have you. Haystack, karma, you will reap what you have sown. And whoever this is for, I don't think this is for that OnlyFans, only me person. That's a low vibrational person. Just saying, just saying. Whoever has that OnlyFans and only me, you are low vibrational. I just want to make that clear. Hey, Sack, Karma, you will reach your week for you have sown. A water sign is about to, masculine, is about to find out about your OnlyFans and your only me. It is not going to go well for you. They're about to tell somebody you don't want them to tell. Okay, that's for the low vibrational one with the only fans, the only me, apparently. Okay, so water sign masculine, cancer Pisces, Scorpio masculine. I heard he's about to find out about your only fans and your only me. Whoever this uh, water sign masculine is to you, Aries fam. Um, but I heard he's about to tell somebody you don't want him to tell. Um, he's about to find out about it, so... I, whoever this person is to you, it's a water sign masculine. So, uh, but he is about to find out about your OnlyFans, Only Me. I'm assuming you haven't told him for specific strategic reasons, Aries fam. But he is about to find out about it and he's about to tell somebody you don't want him to tell. Now, whoever that is, I'm not sure. For one, it's your cousin. For one, it's your mother. For one, it's your cousin and for one, it's your mother. <laughs> oh, man. So, for one, it's two of you Aries fams. For one, it's your cousin, and for one, it's your mother, and for one, it's your lover. One, it's your cousin, one, it's your mother, and for one, it's your lover. So three, one, it's your cousin, one, it's your mother, one, it's your lover. This water sign masculine is about to tell either your cousin, your mother, or your lover. Haystack, karma, you will reap what you have sown. For one of you, Aries fans, with the only fans, only me, this water sign masculine is a co-worker. One, they are an ex-lover. Oh, they're pulling you in so strong. Okay, Aries fan, low vibrational. So for one of you guys, the water sign masculine, that's what to tell your cousin, mother, or lover, current lover, I'm feeling, is either your ex-lover or a co-worker. Cancer Pisces Scorpio masculine. Haystack, karma, you will reap what you have sown. For one, you were severely abused in the past. Severely abused. You are about to receive beautiful karma. It is time. 
For one, you were severely abused in the past. Severely abused. I heard you're about to... You have done your healing and shadow work. You have done your healing and shadow work. Um, for one, Aries, you have were abused in the past. You've done your healing and your shadow work. I feel your high vibrational. I heard you're about to receive beautiful blessings. So beautiful things about to come into your life. I didn't hear specifically what they are, but that's positive karma. If that resonates for you, Aries. Um, your high vibrational being, masculine being, that's beautiful. That's so you'll be posit on the positive side of karmic wheel. And for one, a Libra is secretly sabotaging your business. You're about to start noticing very funny things happening to your business. Your business owner, one is a masculine Libra, one is a femme Libra. Okay, so for one, you're a business owner. I didn't hear specifically what you do, um, but you are a business owner. For one, you could be that OnlyFans person, only me person. For one, it could be any other kind of business. Um, but definite business owner energy, whether it's weird sexual shit or not. Um, but it's at least two of you. Um, Libra and energy uh, sab already sabotaging your business. Um, I heard you're about to start noticing weird things happen with your business, whether it's a Libra masculine or Libra femme. Hacking is significant in this. Hacking is significant in this. So some kind of hacking energy. Um, it's a, I feel it's the online business. Um, the only thing is only me is definitely online, but anything else online, whatever it is, it's online. Whether um, Some kind of hacking, whether it's a Libra femme or Libra masculine. A car show is about to become very significant in Aries' life. And for one, you're about to career change. A car show is about to become very significant in Aries' life. So some kind of car show upcoming. Um, one of you guys like car, likes cars or somebody you're connected to does. Um, some kind of car show is about to become significant in your life. And for one, you're about to career change. So... Um, you plug it in how it resonates. It sounds like it's free willing career change here. Not unsuccessful plans. For one of you, you're about to find out your partner, which you have had open relationship for years, Libra energy, Libra masculine energy, you're Aries femme. But what you don't know is he has been secretly sleeping with your earth sign. Very good friend for a long time. You're about to find them in the act very soon. You probably will take pictures. And use them against him. You are legally married to him. Infidelity. Oh my God. God almighty, whoa. Well, I don't know how that works. I don't know how that works if you're in an open relationship. I, I don't know. I've never been in an open relationship, nor do I ever want to be. But I heard you're legally married. You're in an open relationship. I don't know how you could use infidelity in the court of law when you're in a free willing open relationship. I'm just throwing that out there. But Apparently, it's not somebody you consented and agreed upon for him to be with, though, I'll tell you that. It's some kind of earth sign, very good friend. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Femme, very good friend. I uh, heard they've been doing this for years, very secretly behind your back, ma'am. But y'all have been in an open marriage. But apparently, she was off limits. Um, but she apparently hasn't been off limits, and it hasn't been for years, but you just haven't known this. But you're about to find them in the act, like some kind of sexual act, whether it's... Um, fellatio or insertion or more um i heard you're going to take pictures and try to use them against him in the court of law so i think you're probably going to try to get divorced from him and go for it all with these pictures but i heard y'all been in an open marriage so i don't know how the hell that works um 
You might want to consult a lawyer for that, I would presume. Um, I'm not a lawyer. I don't know how that works. But it hasn't happened yet. I'll tell you that. It hasn't happened yet. It's upcoming in the universe. But she apparently is off limits in y'all's open marriage. Um, and you're legally married to him. But it, I heard it's been going on for years. So if this ends up resonating for you and you have a very good earth sign friend and you're about to find them kicking the boots, knocking the boots, rustling the sheets, and you end up taking pictures, just know they've been doing it for years. Just saying, just saying. Woo! Not unsuccessful plans. For one, you're Aries masculine, Aryan. You've been trying to switch job um, jobs. You've been very frustrated, very frustrated. You will probably have to move out of area to do this. Know this. This is happening for a reason. The people in your workplace, you work in education. The people in your workplace are strategically keeping you stuck. Wow, that's specific. So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so if this resonates for you, you're Aries masculine, Aryan. So you're a registered nurse, Aries masculine. You're a registered nurse like me. But you work in education in some shape, form, or fashion. So I don't know if you're an instructor or you, um, I feel you might be an instructor or, um, or work in education, nursing education in some shape, form, or fashion. I feel an instructor energy. I didn't hear that, but I feel you might be. Or work in education in some shape, form, or fashion. Maybe you do educational videos or something. But how that resonates, you work in education with nursing in some shape, form, or fashion. But you've been lo strategically looking for other jobs. So you're not happy where you're at. You want to move on to other nursing um, avenues, endeavors, experiences, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But I heard you probably will have to end up looking out of area because what you don't know maybe you do maybe you don't i don't you don't know okay i heard you don't know you don't know what you don't know apparently is the reason you're not being successful and as far as far as acquiring another position somewhere else it sounds like in your area it's because of your co-workers your current uh, your nursing education people um they're trying they're strategically keeping you stuck but they're doing all this behind your back. I heard you'll probably have to go out of area looking for jobs or, or possibly move. Um, so, But they want to strategically keep you stuck. They don't want you to move on. That's why. So they're doing all this behind your back. They apparently know you're looking for other jobs. They know you do. Uh, they know you are. They know you are. They know you are. And they don't want you to know this. They know you are and they don't want you to know this. So they know you're looking for other jobs and they don't want you to know this. Your Aries masculine are in and you work in education in some shape or fashion. I feel you might be an instructor or do some kind of educational videos or something. Know what your co-workers do or your bosses. It's somebody around you and where you are. They want to keep you stuck. So unsuccessful plan, stuck energy because they don't want you to move on. For one, you're about to find out a cancer feminine is pregnant by someone else. You have a child with this cancer fem. You're an Aries masculine. Oh my God. Whoa. Okay, so for one of you guys, you're an Aries masculine. You have a child with the cancer fem. Um, I heard you're about to find out she is pregnant by somebody else. So unsuccessful plans. Maybe you're going to try to get back with her romantically or sexually, but you're about to find out she's pregnant. Um, by somebody else. Um, so 
I think for some, you wanted to reconcile with her or get back with her sexually, but it's about to be stuck energy because you're about to find out she's pregnant by somebody else. If it's a cancer fem, you have at least one child with her, if not two or two plus. Um, she could have cancer in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, and Henry, Jupiter charts. If that resonates, it applies for you, Aries masculine. For one, you're an Aries masculine grandfather. You're about to find out you're about to have another grandchild. The parents are under 25 years old. Okay, so for one, you're an Aries masculine and you're about to find out you're about to be a grandfather again. So the parents are under 25 years old. So the mom and the dad of the grandbaby, number two, is under 25, um, is what I'm presuming. Uh, so I'm assuming you probably have to be at least, what, 40, 45, 45, I'd say, 43, 45, something like that. Just ain't just saying. Something like that. Only you know when you had your first child there, Aries masculine, but baby number two, grandparent. You're Aries masculine. Second grand, you're about to have second grandchild, but both of the mom and dad of the child, because you're the grand the grandfather of baby number two, they're 25 or below. So, unsuccessful plans, I don't think anybody planned this. This definitely was not planned. It's about to shock you and many others. This definitely was not planned, and it's about to shock you and many others. So, this number two grandchild of these um, kids, well, I say kids because, hell, I'm 39, of these adults, 25 or below, you're not going to expect it. Many other people aren't going to expect it. They apparently didn't plan to have baby number two. Um, or you didn't plan to have grandchild number two. How that resonates and applies, Aries, masculine. Um, congratulations on being grandfather number two. So kink in the plans here. Grand, you're about to be grandfather number two. Of uh, child number two. Just saying, just saying. You're Aries, masculine. An Aries masculine cousin of a Leo feminine is getting a huge ass wake up call, huge ass wake up call. They're about to call the FBI with very important information of the past, very important information. It is about to be a game changer and really help her out in a huge way, a huge way. This Aries masculine cousin of this Leo femme is on to a Le Libra femme dirty ass plans and previous plans. Okay, so if this resonates with you, you're Aries masculine, cousin of a Leo feminine. Um, and apparently you're connected to a Libra femme and in some shape, form, or fashion. Now, she could be your um, in your family, too, because the Leo femme's in your family. She's a cousin of yours, Aries masculine. Um, she could be in your family or not, but somehow you're connected with the Libra femme, too. I heard you have already been on to the Libra femme's dirty plans, and you're continuing to be on to her dirty plans. But somehow a Leo femme is involved with this. I heard you're about to call the Leo, uh, not to call the Leo fam, call the FBI and um, tell them basic something criminal is going on here. Something criminal is going on. Very criminal. Very criminal. Very criminal. Something very criminal has happened or is still going on or what have you, what have you, but you know about it. And you're about to call the FBI. I heard it's going to, um, it's going to help you out in a huge way. You call the FBI and help this Leo fam out, Leo fam cousin out in a huge way. You're Aries masculine. So unsuccessful plans. I don't think you thought things would happen this way, but they have. Um, and that's why you're about to call the FBI. It is about to be a huge game changer for you and this Leo fam. It is about to be a huge game changer for you and this Leo fam. So you're a cousin of the Leo fam, Aries masculine. You calling the FBI is about to help you out in a positive way and this Leo fam out in a positive way. The Leo fam is your cousin. Um, but somehow the Libra fam, whether she is a part of your family or not, is part of this too. You're Aries masculine and you have a cousin, Leo fam cousin. I don't think you thought it would happen this way, but it did. Fair, danger, especially in money matters. 
Another Aries is getting a huge wake-up call. A very huge wake-up call. Former boss of Leo Fem. Okay, another Aries. Uh, former boss of Leo Fem is getting a huge wake-up call. Fair, danger, especially in money matters. A condominium that was bought for prostitution is about to be busted. The city is on to this, and they have been on to this for many, many, many months. They're about to bust this open. Somebody needs to hear this. A condominium that was has been used for prostitution. One, you own this condominium. One, you own this condominium. So for one, you own this condominium. It's in a city, and it's being used for prostitution. But I heard um, the city has been, um, I'm assuming the police or investigators or a combination or what have you, what have you. I heard they've been on to this for months, for months. And I heard it's about to be busted. It is about to go way more public than you thought it ever would go. Many people are about to get arrested in this. High-end prostitution. Oh my God, I heard this is about to go way more public than anybody ever thought it would go. It's high-end prostitution. So I'm assuming it's a nice condominium. A very nice condominium. A very nice condominium. Very nice condominium, high-end prostitution in the city. But one of you guys owns it. And so you're about to get embarrassed when your prostitution, high-end prostitution gig gets busted up there, Aries. Um, whoever you are, one of you guys owns it. So you know who you are, not anybody else. But just know you high-end prostitutes I heard many people about to get arrested. So many people are about to get arrested in this shindig. But it's high-end prostitution and you own the condominium for one of you. So just know this, the police and the city and many people have been onto this shit for months. A neighbor in this is not messing around. And they have, they have been in contact with the police for a, a while. And they have photos. The police are about to move in soon. Okay, Aries that owns this escort prostitution type nice condominium. Just know that apparently there's a neighbor. It sounds like it's in a high-end nice area. Because I heard high-end prostitution. So it's a nice condominium. I heard nice condominium. But one of the neighbors of this condominium has been on this for months. And I heard they've been in contact with the police. And they've been taking photos, I guess, of the different nice-looking, probably, men and women coming out of there. And probably, I wonder if they're recording the weird voices. Just saying, just saying. But, I didn't hear they were, but I just wonder if they are. But, I heard they this neighbor has been in contact. They're not messing around. They've been in contact with the police for months. And the police are about to move in on it. And I heard it's going to be very, very, very public. And many people are about to get arrested. Probably these high-end prostitutes. So you plug it in how it resonates. The neighbor's not playing around. They don't want prostitution. High, I don't care if it's high-end or not in their complex, apparently. When, these people are about to start moving in soon. People are about to get arrested, and it is about to embarrass the hell out of you. Okay, our people are about to start moving in soon. It sounds like these high-end prostitutes are about to start getting arrested, and it's going to embarrass the hell out of you. Condominium owner, Aries. And when this occurs, legal action will occur for you. Know this. And when this occurs, legal action will occur for you. And when this occurs, Aries masculine condominium owner of the high-end prostitution situation, I heard um, legal action will occur for you, so just know that. Um, whoever you are. Only you know who you are, not anybody else. Bear, danger, especially in money matters. Stock market investments are about to tank for one.
For one, you're about to be in such heavy legal issues with this prostitution bust up. It is about to go very badly for you. Oh, Lord. Okay, so I'm pulling you in high, um, high end condominium owner here that is pimping out all these renting. Oh, well, I don't know what the hell you're doing with this condo, but you're allowing all these um, high end prostitutes basically to purvey it for sex. I'll tell you that. Um, so it sounds like you might be a pimp there, sir, ma'am. Just saying. Um, but you definitely know about it. You are, you're the owner of the damn condo. Um, but how that resonates, the one, the owner of the condo, legal issues about, heavy legal issues about to come for you, they bear danger and money matters, I think, because your shindig's about to be exposed. And for one, um, some kind of stock market investments, stock market investments are about to start. Tanking. So, Bayer, Danger, Man Money Matters, Stark Market, and whoever the hell this uh, escort, wh whoever owns this condo, and you're allowing high-end hoes, basically, to sex it up in there all night long. Just saying, just saying. I didn't hear anything else. Okay. I'd be careful. I'd watch my bank accounts. I'd watch my money, my investments. I'd really be watching my accounts and money that I have in my home and my saves, etc., etc., etc. We have the bear dangerous, especially money matters. Patience. For one, you're patiently waiting on news and you're about to get it. For one, someone else is patiently waiting on news and they're about to get it. Okay, so for one of you guys, you're patiently waiting on news and you're about to get it. For one of you guys, for one, somebody else is patiently waiting on news and they're about to get it. So whatever news that is and how that applies, Aries. For one, you have a child and they're about to go to a Thanksgiving dinner at another house soon. They're going to come back and tell you shocking news. You're going to take great action. Okay, so for one of you guys, um, you have a child and they're going to go um, have Thanksgiving dinner at a different home, it sounds like, soon, at a different residence. But it sounds like when they come home, they're going to tell you shocking news. And I heard basically... Um, uh, when they when they t come back and tell you shocking news, you're going to take great action. So you plug it in how it resonates, Aries. Love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful day, and I'm safe.